Hi, my name is Staff Sergeant Velasquez, and today we are here running through trauma lanes for the CLS class that we have been teaching all week. So CLS is Combat Lifesaver, and it's a one-week course or 40-hour course that students run through where they learn the TCCC, which is Tactical Combat Casualty Care, the phases of care, and how to go through them, the applications that we use for them, as well as um, life-saving measures and EVAC. So for today, the students have gone the entire week of learning hands-on, step-by-step, the way you should manage a patient, as well as uh, the roles in the phases of uh, TC3. What we do is we start them through phase one and run them all the way to the very end. So that way they can apply everything that they've learned as far as uh, hemorrhage control and then airway management and then packaging a patient, calling in a nine line and getting them ready to uh, be evacuated. So I think that the students have gotten everything that they need as far as hands-on training goes, but when it comes to the lanes, there's a little bit of nervousness that is to be expected because they come up here and receive a scenario uh, individually. They don't all get the same scenario, so they don't really know what to expect, um, but then they take and place everything that they've learned and, and put it into play and, and roll with it. And so you can see some high anxiety and a little bit of stress that we place on them by using noise of battle as well as some elevated voices, letting them know where, uh, where they could speed up the processes. The skill is very important because you have a lot of injuries that are on the battlefield and before they get back to a camp or a base or a hospital, like applying tourniquets, life-saving measures that can, that can save somebody's life, obviously, right before they get to a higher level of care. Can I go here also? No, 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 oh, sorry, here. Sorry. Sorry. You need to feel for that.